I'm just so happy you're here. Yeah, I'm so happy to see you. I know you're probably wondering what's going on right now. To be clear, yes, that is me with a professional cuddle therapist again. To understand how we got here, we're going to have to start from the beginning. A year ago today, when I was fresh out of my hip surgery, all my side pieces started to act up. I needed someone to hold me close while I was healing, so I hired a cuddle therapist. Although the experience was amazing, I thought I would never do it again. Since that day, my riz has just never been the same. I started to get nervous when I would talk to girls that I've been with in the past. When I would try to find a woman when I was out, I just felt like they didn't notice me anymore. I couldn't use Tinder because it's filled with bots, so I started to use Hinge. Eight likes a day just wasn't enough. I tried so many things like going for walks, taking long drives, and even going to the gym, but I still found myself lost. A few words to describe how I felt could be rejected, unwanted, and estranged. It took me days to think about it, but it was finally time. I kept the link in an extremely confidential folder because it's for emergencies only. As soon as I found it, I felt my heart get warm. The site loaded up, I navigated to my preferred cuddle therapist, booked the next session, and I finally felt like myself again. Today's the day, y'all. Got the cuddle therapist coming. You know, it's been a while since I had that physical touch that all of us men need. I thought it was finally time to just rehire a cuddle therapist. I got some cuddle positions here that I want to do. The uh, Mama Baby Bear, Hug Boat, Lack of Luxury, Yin Yang, Mother's Embrace, the Lotus. It's going to be an incredible time. I'm going to finally get that physical touch that I've been missing for so, so, so long. I had to hire my favorite cuddle therapist personally. I think she's on her way right now. Let's see what the roommates got to say, man. Hey, Graham. I have someone coming. Okay. That's a cuddle therapist. Again? Yeah. I think it's just finally time, so I hired her again. I appreciate you for accepting me. I love you. I love you too, man. I have a cuddle therapist coming again, Dom. You've probably noticed me feeling a little down recently. I think it's finally time for me to just tell you guys that she is coming again. This is good for you. Yeah, I think I need it. I appreciate you guys for accepting me, for making these decisions. You guys are some of the best roommates I've ever had. <laughs> all right, guys, uh, I think she's about to pull up. I really, really can't wait, though, because y'all seen all the events that led to me getting to this point and everything. It's finally the time I'm going to get cuddled again. It's been a minute, man, so I know a lot of y'all out there, a lot of y'all men, y'all probably have went long, long times without feeling that physical touch and affection, but now you can get it. You just gotta hire a cuddle therapist. Definitely do it. 20 minutes later. Hey. <laughs> What's up? How are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm pretty good. It's good uh, to see you good again. Good to see you. Damn, I'm so excited. Should I leave my shoes over here? You can leave all your stuff in my room. Okay, sure. Yeah, you don't gotta leave anything out here. All right. Do you want to reintroduce yourself for anyone Hi, new? Hi, everybody. I'm Zandria. I'm a cuddle therapist. All right. Is it okay if we just start the same way as last time? As yeah. maybe in a little spoon? This is a spoon. I like to put my arm kind of under your neck. Okay. So get it crushed. Yes. I love your uh, whiteboard. It says get cuddled. Okay. It's like the only thing I have to do today. Oh, nice. I kind of just had to take this day out to just like make sure I get this out the way because it's yeah. been some time since I felt like physical touch. So I know last time we talked about Riz tips. Yeah. How is that going? Horrible. Do you think anybody in your audience might want to go on a date with you? If there's any bad Jones watching this, please slide in the DM. I need you. He's good at cuddling if you like to cuddle. Thank you for the vouch. Yeah. I'm so happy this day has come. And that's facts, man. I was stressed until I scheduled this session. And just like last time, Sandra got right to the head rubs. This is your time, so we can do whatever you want position-wise. You know, I'm here to listen to whatever problems you have, whatever you need to talk about. All emotions are welcome. Sandra made me feel comfortable about opening up, so I did. And I told her what led me to hiring her. Since my hip surgery, all my side joints started to act up. What do you mean, like, act up? They wasn't trying to come see me, like... Mm. I yeah. mean, can you still, like, get it on with them? Or yeah! Yeah, so it still works. Like, yeah. there's no reason they're, they should ghost you. It was only my hip. It still could have been <laughs> yeah. a movie. Yeah. And now we cut to a word from family and friends. 
What do you think about Destin hiring a cuddle therapist? I definitely don't think it was the best decision, but teach their own. Honestly, I don't really think it's that big of a deal. I mean, like if you need some free coochie, I totally understand it. Cause me and him both get no hoes. I think he's a fucking asshole. Why the fuck do he need a cuddle therapist? Trouble in bed, sir? Like, I'm confused. Where do you think his problem lies? I think his problem lies in his Instagram DMs. Them bitches just be playing games on him, man. <sighs> but then, get in no pussy, like, that shit costs. And actually hiring a cuddle therapist. I think that's when he really needs to sit back and recollect and think, okay, maybe something's not right. Do you think this will be his last session? By the way things are going, it definitely doesn't look like it's going to be his last session. I'm guessing he's going to need a lot more where they came from. I understand, like, I know how it feels getting no coochie, but like, you got bills to pay, you got dreams to chase. Worst case scenario, get a little massage parlor, get her over with, get it done, get your nut. We got things to do. Back to the program. I just gotta be myself. Yeah. I be trying to act cool. Life is too short to play games and like put on these personas. What about the like Nigerian prince though? <laughs> That's like a scam. That's not like a person. Wait, I'm the Nigerian prince. You're not a Nigerian prince. Yes, I am. You didn't know? But you live here in Philly with roommates. Yeah, but that's because I'm on a Nigerian prince okay. getaway. Okay. When people find out that you're a rich Nigerian prince, they kind of just treat you different. Yeah. So right now, I'm just trying to play cool, lay low. Yeah. But when it's time to be Nigerian prince, I suit up and I go out and then I actually act like myself. Okay. Mm -hmm. Believe it or not, I really am a Nigerian prince. And for anyone watching that doesn't know, sometimes I upload Nigerian prince videos where I act with myself. But that's beside the point. It was time to do one of our last positions. How does this work? Just yeah. put the pillow right there. If you don't need it, you don't have to. Comments, what do you guys think? Pillow or no pillow? Leave below. Ah, they said no pillow. Okay. All right. All right. Maybe. Yeah, so the way I handle erections is basically, I just don't want to feel it. If Des was to have an erection right now, I No, I didn't have one. I just have him like scooch back a little. It's normal, it's biology, like just being close to someone can elicit that reaction. It's not a big deal. Thank you for being mindful, I appreciate it. No, yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course. After cuddling with Andrew for a little while and just getting more and more comfortable and sharing a few laughs, I felt like it was finally time. I think we can get some off-camera cuddling now. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, he's, he's, he's horny again. He's horny again. <laughs> if you're real horny, you gotta do what you gotta do. I mean, consensually. And if you're home and you're horny, I mean, I guess just go outside, try to touch some grass, try to get that feel. That dog is still in you. You gotta find a way to, find a way to let that thing run. Thank you so much. Of course, yeah. Really, really appreciate you. Oh. Yeah. All right. I will see you. We'll talk. All right, peace out. All right. right now, as y'all can see, the energy is different. I feel good. Uh, you know, now I might go to the club. I might, you know what I'm saying, feel the confidence to bag a shorty. Now that I had that physical touch and that affection and stuff that I've been missing. So I hope you enjoyed the video though. I appreciate y'all for watching. I'm see y'all see you. Motivated the pain, won't let it break me. I just really like love you. <laughs> Everybody just look really happy is the thing. Really happy. <laughs> Dom, look at them. Look at them. Do you think Destin had a boner during his therapy session? A thousand percent did. Because who would Fuck you, Des. Come fuck me.